I'll tell you, the, the proudest moment I had on WKBN radio was when Pete Gabriel took charge during the tornadoes in 1985, and he said, we're dropping the commercials, we're going live. It started in the evening after the tornadoes hit the Niles area. It continued through the overnight. Uh, I was supposed to be out and rolling radio at Farmore in Niles, and he called me up and said, Rich, this is Saturday morning, he said, Rich, you're not going anywhere because you can't get to Niles because of the tornado. You're coming in. And what we would do is we'd be on the air and we're taking phone calls. People are trying to find their relatives. We didn't have cell phones back then. So people were trying to get connected with their relatives. They couldn't leave their homes maybe, or they were still in the basement. And so we provided them a, a link to a lot of their relatives. We had Roland Radio out with Dan Rivers going to different sites to give us an idea of what the roads were like. And eventually, we continued this into the afternoon, and finally, WKBN-TV decided to simulcast our radio program on TV to continue our coverage. And that sort of solidified our weather coverage in the Valley, and I think that's why we're the number one source for weather in this area, because of what we did in 1985, first on radio and then on TV.